hello friends welcome to my youtube channel it planet so today in this video we are going to see the exercise solution of computer book for class 3 chapter number 3 paint 3d wow so many three are here chapter 3 class 3 paint 3d okay now start the exercise solution okay and the first question is tick the correct answer in that first question in 2d and 3d the d specifies this d stands for dimensions involved in the shape right that d stands for dimensions dash option is used for selection of filter color or the lighting so we use effects option okay next question we can erase a shape with which tool for erase we use eraser tool okay click on 3d text icon to all 3d text to the project to add okay see this will be add i think right click on 3d text icon to add 3d text into the project okay next question we can use rotation tools to see the 3d effects if you want to see the 3d effects then use rotation tools okay next question question number b that is write t for true statement and f for false statements in that first statement is paint 3d is an updated version of ms paint yeah this is correct this is true statement paint 3d is the updated version of ms paint 3d shapes are also known as flat shapes this is false statement 3d shapes are not for flat state uh, shapes right effects option contains many options like new open etc to work with there might be some sentence is missing right uh, but this statement is false statement second one open etc to work with uh, effect option contains many options like new open etc to work with no this is not uh, in complete sentence this is complete sentence it's saying that effects option contains many options effect option both are options with like new open etc to work so this is false statement there are many other options as, as well you can change the color of three objects according to your choice and absolutely this is true statement we can change color anytime next statement paint 3d stickers come in the form of shapes traditional stickers and surface textures yes this is true statements so let's see next type of question that is fill in the blanks in fill in the blanks let's start with one first that is paint 3d is a drawing program developed by microsoft so this paint 3d who developed this paint 3d microsoft right and it is available in windows operating systems a 3d shape compromises of three dimensions in 3d there are three dimensions and which are those three dimensions height width and length text option is used to add 3d text in paint 3d so text option is used stickers are used to add texture and icons to our 2d or 3d drawings so the answer is texture and icons next is rotation tools appear when we select an object from 3d library the answer is rotation next question is differentiate between the following in that we have 2d shapes and 3d shapes okay in 2d shapes a 2d shape is flat and comprises of two dimensions that are length and width in 2d there are only two dimensions length and width but in 3d there are three dimensions length width and height right these shapes are also known as flat shapes 2d shapes are also known as flat shapes and these shapes the 3d shapes looks like solid and real okay next type of question is 
answering following questions uh, and there are four questions in that let's see first question answer what is the use of 3d software and here is the answer paint 3d is used to create edit and print 3d shapes it allows you to make creative projects using 2d and 3d tools second question is why do we use rotation tools rotation tool that is x axis y axis and z axis yes appears around the objects when we use rotation tool then these three axes x y z three axis appear around the object you can use these tools to see the 3d effect right the second uh, third number question what are the forms in which stickers come in paint 3d so here is the answer paint 3d stickers come in the form of shapes like lines curves squares and stars traditional stickers like cloud swirl or rainbow and facial features and surface textures next from question number four that is from where do we add 3d objects in a project so to in order to add three objects in your project you can add three objects in your project from 3d library yes 3d library we have to use 3d library next application based question is there sonika is working on maths projects in which she needs to create 3d shapes which software can she use for this purpose so for this purpose she can use paint 3d so friends this is the exercise solution for class 3 chapter 3 and if you like this video don't forget to hit like button and subscribe the channel thank you for watching the video bye bye and take care